Okay, myself Abhilash. So I am working as a project manager in Agash project. So today we are covering basics of Linux, including installation, software configuration. So I think most of the participants know what is Linux. Some of them are already very well in Linux. I know that, but anyway, eighty percent of the participants are. New to Linux, so we want to start it from the basics. So I will tell something about Linux. Actually, Linux was originally created by Linux Torvald. It is an open source, so you can freely download, you can edit, and you can distribute. Most of the people are familiar with Windows. All of them know if you purchase a Windows XP or Windows Server. For a Windows XP or Windows 7, it will cost around six thousand to seven thousand rupees, but you can use it for only one PC. Also, if you go for a server, suppose Windows 2008 server or 2003 server, so you want to pay around fifty thousand to one lakh. So it is also limited. Maybe you can use one P or server to five or six maximum ten. So it is creating problem. Means some of the institute Is not able to afford for an infrastructure to spend this type of money. So if you go for Linux, it is freely available. You can download it and you can use it. You can install in desktops as well as servers, because desktop edition is also available. Server edition is also available. The advantages of Linux, one is I already mentioned, it is low cost. There is no cost. But in Red Hat, we want to pay. If you purchase RGL six or something, then you want to pay some money. But it is only for support. Otherwise, if you there is no need for support, then you can use it as a free one. Second one is it is very stable. The Linux is very stable, and it is virus free. If you purchase a Windows, then you want to purchase an antivirus also. Otherwise, it is not secure. Lot of virus is coming. So if you install Ubuntu, otherwise any Linux flavors, then there is no worry about the virus things. And third one is the high security. In Linux, it is very high security. So next, I want to describe. There are lot of distributions are available, like Ubuntu. There are variety of distributions are available. The famous distributions are Debian, Fedora, CentOS, OpenSUSE, etc. so regarding this workshop actually we already send the 10.0.4 cds to all the remote senders and also also we uploaded on the moodle so i think most of the remote senders got the cds and some of them are not received i think they download it from the moodle and ready for installation as well as the packages the next thing is the package cd will uh the uploaded ubuntu version is 10.0.4 32 bit the software cd will work with only that distribution because we are make it for that version only all the softwares are not available on that cd only a limited softwares are available on the cd We got some queries from different remote senders because they have already 12.04 and they have already 12.10, 11.10. That's all. It is fine for the workshop. So basically, you want to set up a server. That server is only for Agash related activities because we are giving in IIT Bombay. We are developing some packages and we will. Put that packages. We have our own repository here. It is like exactly like Google Play. We will post all the packages and updates in that server. You people want to mirror in this 250 different location. You people want to mirror that um, that server. So for that purpose only we are using Ubuntu. Any distribution you can use 
for the server it is debian fedora sandos open source ubuntu anything but one thing is what are the uh, topics we are covering what are the softwares we are installing for the next 2 days it should work on that server that is the only one condition otherwise there is no need for degrading your server there is no need for changing the server nothing you can use any linux distribution but that package should work on that platform that's all so next thing i want to mention is uh, we got lot of queries about uh, lab setup for uh, 10th and 11th workshop 11th workshop uh, during that workshop we are uh, actually we are not using any pcs for installation or nothing but we are using that time we are using tablets how you can use this akash tablet for engineering education for that purpose only we are using but that time we need a lab that purpose is uh, in the moodle we will conduct quiz as well as feedback we want to collect feedback from all the remote centers for that purpose we need a lab so that time the um, participant can go to the lab and fill the form that's the only one condition okay if you have any queries regarding this you can just ask me i will try to answer there is a question from one of the sender can we use another distribution of linux yes you can use another distribution of linux no issues but what are the packages we are using tomorrow and day after tomorrow it should work on that distribution that is the only one condition someone is specifying yum command yum command maybe you are using fedora that's why you are using yum command is this also possible but you want to install yum then it's also possible please tell about wifi requirements wifi requirement means um, for connecting akash tablet for getting internet connection you need a wifi so you can purchase a wifi router otherwise links is a lot of wifi access points are available is like links is dealing netgear you can purchase one belkin some of things are available you can purchase one from the market and you can configure it and use connected to your lan and you can use it is necessary to purchase wi yes for tomorrow sessions there is no need to purchase a wifi if you have wifi you can see because in different remote centers uh, people are using different wifi so like i already specify this like linksys or cisco otherwise dealing netgear something so maybe tomorrow we will show it through linksys wifi so you can purchase any one of the wifi and you can configure okay most of the people are saying you are not able to see your package so you just go to the moodle then you can see there is a software installation pdf is there in the pdf exact screenshot is there you can go through it then you will understand so when we need a wifi for the 10th and 11th main workshop you need a wifi for that workshop you need wifi 